I think I prefer my jackpots shaken, not stirred. Is the ace of Vegas, the ace of Vegas. You know, I gotta admit, I never thought I'd be doing a James Bond parody on my channel here. Welcome back to Ace of Vegas, guys. Ace here. And today, we're gonna go ahead and play Sevens Are Forever. Or, apparently, Sevens Forever. Whichever. <laughs> um, obviously, this is a, this is kind of a dig on the James Bond series, which is pretty cool. I think they do have a James Bond slot machine in most of the, uh, most of the big hotels there. Uh, they, they have a lot of branded slot machines, so it's not a special or a weird sort of thing at all, too. So, uh, let me go ahead and, uh, see what the bets are looking like. 800,000. You know, let's go ahead and do 1,500. We'll go ahead and bring it up to, if we get nine sevens, then I guess that'll be a pretty big jackpot right there. Hopefully, we'll get something over six and knock out a couple of those, too. All right, folks, so let's go ahead and do it. We're going to go ahead and put 100 spins on the clock on your mark. Get set, ready, and go. Okay, so I'm actually pre-recording this. As you guys know, I usually do pre-record these, but as you don't know, today I'm actually on holiday. So today's Tuesday. I'm going to be in... Uh, Minnesota right now. Can't remember if we're doing the Raptor Center today or not. Going with uh, going with Miss Bowes. So one day is going to be my lovely tour guide, and she's going to show me all around the Twin Cities. And we're going to do some cool stuff. We'll go up to one of the Ten Thousand Lakes. Um, I'll probably have to bring uh, one of my swords too, so I can kill the mosquitoes because they are the size of loons. And yes, guys, loons are real things. I thought that they were ducks. They are apparently not ducks. They are more closely related to. I think it was quails or something like that, which I find uh, very bizarre, but that's not the point. So there's going to be a lot of uh, a lot of mosquitoes the size of uh, planes there, so I'll have to take care of those. And uh, also we're going to go to the Raptor Center to see some actual large birds of prey, which will be pretty dope. And looks like we got ourselves our first bonus over here. We get th three total spins. Let's go. Here we are. Q, what gadgets do you have for us today? Oh, we got a cutscene. I don't think I've ever seen a cutscene in these games before. This is new. All right, let's see how we do. Also, what's your guys' favorite uh, Bond movie? Um, I'm I'm definitely very par partial to GoldenEye myself. Um, that's mainly because I played the uh, GoldenEye game as a kid on the N64 a whole lot, and that was probably one of the best. I mean, it was like the first-person shooter at the time. It revolutionized the game, really. So. Excellent, uh, excellent game. If you guys haven't played it or haven't gotten the Project 64 emulator, I highly recommend it. Definitely go check it out and uh, play it on your uh, PC when you get time. Oh, it looks like we are... Oh, so are these all three of our spins here? Oh, that's a big win because we got sevens all day. All right, that's six million. That's pretty good. <laughs> these explosions directed by Michael Bay. Total win. 12 million chips. Only here on Sevens, Ace of Vegas style. And then we're going to go ahead and go back to the main game here. Yeah, that was. Yeah, that's a pretty intense cutscene. They're getting really intricate with these games here now. Wow. Okay. Well, anyway. So, yeah, we're going to be going to the lakes. Uh, we're also going to make sure that we spend some time uh, spend some time with the family, too. Uh, going to be visiting with the in-laws, so that'll be a good time there. Uh, I'm trying to think of what else what we're going to do. Um, or really have... Oh, apparently we're doing another bonus game here real quick, guys. So three total spins on three different passports here. Let's go, let's go. Evidently, my Vegas doesn't want me boring you guys with the details of my holiday. <laughs> That's a non-Vegas thing. Also, I was going to ask you, would you guys mind terribly if I posted some vlogs of us going and doing some fun things around Minnesota? So, like I said, um, we're going to the Raptor Center, so we're going to go see some hawks and falcons and that sort of thing there. I haven't been there. We're going to go tour some of the lakes, too. Not sure if anyone's terribly interested in that. Uh, maybe get some history behind that, too. I uh, might go down to downtown Minneapolis or downtown St. Paul. Can't remember which side of the bridge we're going to be on for most of the time, but um, 
we'll definitely figure it out. Uh, I'll be there by the time uh, by the time you guys see this for sure, and I'll probably be back um, before anyone uh, tells me either way. So I might just vlog it anyway. Oh, look at that total win, 750. Oh, we got nothing on that. We got nothing on that. Dang it. Don't talk about uh, Minneapolis when uh, when you're t playing a video <laughs> a Vegas video game. Evidently, that's a pity. All right, right then. I really should have done this whole video in a British accent. That would have been quite amazing. Then the whole Austin Powers thing. Oh, whoa, we got a six times bonus. What now, guys? Oh, nothing. Nothing on that one. Yeah, there's another parody I definitely enjoy. Austin Powers. <laughs> definitely one of my personal favorites, like Austin. I, I, I like parodies and spoofs. Uh, Mel Brooks is probably one of my favorite comedians of all time. And I just love, you know, Spaceballs, uh, Robin Hood, Men in Tides, Blazing Saddles, Young Frankenstein, that sort of thing, too. There was one movie I hadn't seen before I met my spouse, uh, actually. It was High Anxiety. Brilliant movie, but it was basically like you took any Hitchcock movie and he tore it apart. It was amazing. You guys got to check that one out if you didn't see it. Definitely, uh, definitely some of his best work. It's a pity that we don't have uh, Mel Brooks doing uh, much of anything anymore. Um, I think he pops in and acts on certain things too, but drastically underrated comedian. Probably my favorite comedian of all time. Um, I'd probably say it's like him. Uh, Dave Chappelle's another one that's up there too. I know he's like super controversial right now, but you know he he hits hard because he he hits the truth too. There are some some things he says that's just like really super true, and I don't think people like that. And it's okay that people don't like that because that means you gotta. I I, I think that just means you gotta do some introspection on yourself. If you hear something that's true and it really kind of hits you in a certain way, you gotta do some introspection and do better with yourself there too. I mean. And I hear some things, I'm like, oh, that, that hit in a certain way, but at the same time, it's like, why did this bother me? Is there something about it? Do I resemble that remark? Is there something that I'm doing wrong that I gotta step my game up on? You know, it's, you know, I see it as the same as the YouTube videos over here. If, um, you know, if someone says something about the audio, the audio sucks. I mean, is it the audio sucks? Do I need to step my game up? Do I need a new microphone? Do I need a... <laughs> you know, that, that, that sort of thing. All right, but looks like uh, yeah, looks like we're getting to hopefully some free spins here. We're not getting any free spins. Dang it! Oh well. Also, here's another idea I had. I was wondering if you guys wanted to live stream uh, picking some rewards for me. I wanted to see about picking out a few rewards here on stream, maybe one of these days, just for my upcoming uh, November trip. So be going November 18th, uh, 2019. You guys actually did vote. Technically, Arya won the votes, but Arya had some blackout days. So unfortunately, I'm gonna have to do the next best thing, which is Vidara. You didn't send me to MGM Grand. Thank you guys, I appreciate that. And it looks like we got some emeralds over here, so thank you for that. And let's see how we do with this. This full motion uh, cutscene over here. Yeah, mobile games have gotten so intricate. They used to be, in a very short period of time, it just kind of shows you how well the technology's advanced and how quickly it's advanced. And why didn't that hit? I thought that counted for something. Man, these three real slots are relentless. That's a one times, what's that mean? 750,000. Yeah, good old uh, gold bond over here is not really helping us out too much, is he? Let's see, big win. Oh, okay, so I called him out. Thirteen and a half million, okay, that's a, that's a hit, that's a hit. I swear I still lost, like, uh, 40 million over here, this is ridiculous. So 14.25 million, very good. Okay, and we're also racking up some loyalty points too, so I'm, I'm really looking forward to spending some loyalty points. Uh, yeah, we should totally just do that on stream, we should absolutely do a stream. Um, maybe, maybe this upcoming Sunday, you know what? I'm actually gonna go ahead and just ask you guys that on today's poll here. Whoa! And we got more diamonds back to back to back to back. That is awesome. <laughs> How did this happen? How does this just keep happening? That's amazing. Man, look at all these free spins. This is probably the longest best slots in Vegas we've done in a very long time here. I don't think we've had a best slots in my Vegas slots that's uh, gone on this long for a while. I haven't had this many bonus features. It's really kind of making up for the fact that we're not really winning in this game over here. We really aren't. 
we're down a good, uh, I think we started at uh, 1.535, yeah, um, 1.5 billion, over 1.5 billion we started at. And now we're down to 1.4 billion. So we've definitely lost uh, the better part of 60 million chips here. It's pretty bad. Hopefully we get some more really good uh, good hits here. Oh, oh, what do we got? What do we got? Let's get a multiplier. Oh, that's a seven. Sevens aren't multipliers. I mean, they are, but they aren't. Oh, yeah, that's a bad hit. That's a bad hit. Pity about that. Oh, now we get our big time seven multiplier. I think I'm kind of starting to figure out how these uh, bets work over here. So you get the bar, you get the triple bar, and then you get the five times bonus on top of the bars and all that. And that's uh, and, and it's based on your initial bet line over here. I really would like to learn how to read slot machines. Um, if you guys know a Vegas super that knows how to read slot machines or someone that knows how to read slot machines, reach out to me in the comment section down below. Let me know because I really want to learn how to do that and really want to do a tutorial on that, something that we could definitely do together. Definitely give you a shout out, get your uh, Twitter page, uh, some followers to or if you're a YouTuber yourself, let's definitely do that collaboration, get that crossover going. All right, cool. So we're on the latter half of the spins over here. All right, 70, yeah, so we're up to 75 spins so far. Oh, wait, are we gonna get these forever spins? Oh, what is this? What is this? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight? What do we get for eight? That's a huge jackpot. 31 million, that darn Mulnira made up for a lot of the uh, chips that we lost already. Nice, okay. I keep forgetting about that Forever 7's uh, jackpot right there, and it doesn't seem to be dropping our bet any, so that's good. Uh, on the last 20 spins, and we're actually making a lot of progress here, uh, no dice on that last set of Forever 7's there. But yeah, maybe maybe for the stream, I don't think I had anything ready for the podcast Sunday, or at least nothing major. I did kind of want to talk about Circus Circus a little bit too, uh, but we'll see. But yeah, maybe for the podcast Sunday, that's what we'll go ahead and do. We're going to go ahead and do some uh, live stream of picking rewards. I think that'll actually be pretty dope. So let's do that. I'm going to go ahead and ask that in today's poll. It's Saturday right now, so it'll put it up in today's poll. Or Friday, I don't, I don't remember what day it is right now, but it's going to be in today's poll. And that's what we're going to do. We're going to live stream that-ish. <laughs> nice. Okay, we're coming down to the last 10 spins here. Uh, hopefully, we'll get something else big. Maybe some more Balls with Words. Also, shout out to Hog and Two Cent, because Balls with Words, those are things. <laughs> Hashtag Balls with Words. <laughs> Although I definitely would like to see the diamonds with numbers. And Q's just showing up, Bond's showing up, and whatever Bond Girl of the Week is also showing up on this over here. But we're not getting a lot of matches. And let's go ahead and spin it down one more time. Here we go. And let's go three, two, one, make some noise. Nothing. All right, guys. So it looks like we ended at 1,482,405,919 chips over here. So I'm gonna go ahead and do some quick maths. Now that we've put about 150 million chips through the machine, that's uh, 1.5 million. Uh, we did that 100 times, so that's about 150 million chips we've put through the machine. I'm gonna figure out how many we pulled out, uh, do some maths over here, and we'll uh, count up the booty. All right, guys. Well, the record for this game is looking a little more like the Austin Powers movies compared to the James Bond movies. We had about a 64.34% payback, which is about the percentage of good uh, Austin Powers movies we had compared to James Bond movies. So it's about two out of three. Not bad, but definitely not good enough to uh, reach the uh, favorite list on best slots in My Vegas Slots. Uh, you know, I honestly have lost track of how many slots we've done we've done so many of these things at this point uh, we're coming right down to the wire i almost want to just do like a marathon game and knock all these out all at once just to see how well it goes but i feel like that hinders the integrity of the experiment that i've been doing for the last year on these games so i don't know let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below uh, until next time then, my spinners and sharks, Ace of Vegas is signing out, wishing it strong hands, happy spinning, and then, yeah, I'll see you guys when I'm back from holiday. Thank you.